Trey Mitchell has been in a rut since his recent divorce. But on this muggy September night, his brother Rick is determined to get him off the couch. So he went out for dinner with his brother with some friends. Trey seems to be having a good time. Until suddenly, he excuses himself, complaining that his arthritic knee is acting up. But Dr. G has a different theory. Certainly, most people don't leave a dinner because of knee pain. Uh, but they will leave a dinner if they have chest pain. Based on her findings, she suspects that Trey was actually suffering from an acute heart condition called Prince Metal's Angina. It's a fancy name, but it's just spasm of the coronary artery. There's no consensus among experts as to exactly what causes Prince Metal's. But one thing is for sure, its effects can be extremely dangerous. What's happening in his body is probably about the time he's uh, having dinner or maybe even a little bit before dinner, uh, his coronary artery uh, starts to spasm. During the spasm, the smooth layer of muscle within the walls of the artery quivers and contracts. Even in a heart without coronary artery disease, the spasms could be harmful. But Trey's arteries are 50% blocked by plaque. And with the blood vessel just kind of constricting down, it would be easier than to totally cut off that blood supply uh, if you already have some plaque there. With each contraction, the spasm temporarily deprives his heart of fresh blood and oxygen until it finally triggers a devastating chain reaction. The spasm is causing then this area of heart muscle to die off because it's not getting enough blood. At this point, Trey is suffering a heart attack, but the symptoms are so mild, he never imagines his life is in danger. He's probably feeling maybe some indigestion, uh, maybe even pain. Uh, he goes home, uh, isn't feeling well. Trey lies down in bed, hoping that his chest pain will pass. But it only worsens as the dying tissue begins to cripple the heart's delicate electrical system. Anytime you start killing off, uh, that heart muscle, the, heart, the electrical component becomes very irritated and kind of twitchy, and it can easily set up a cardiac arrhythmia. Trey's heartbeat eventually turns erratic, disrupting the flow of blood to all of his vital organs. Starved of oxygen, they shut down, and just hours after the coronary spasm, he dies. <laughs> 